much you like the Aria badge on any outfit of your choice. So yeah, works on male and female character, no losing outfits on console method. So yeah, this method works on any UAP missions. So yeah, I'm not the founder, I'm not sure who's the founder, but let me know in the comments. Like always, like and subscribe, we're on the road to 4k, like it started. For me, we head over to the UAP location, you should be a big yellow U on the map by the IA building. Okay. From here, next step you want to open your pause menu, go to online, select play playlist, create one, and basically you want to add a stun race. Add any one stun race, so it should, be, should just be one, to add any one, so yeah. So I'm going to select this one. After that, you want to back out and save the playlist. You can name it anything, I name it IA badge, you can name it IA badge or anything of your choice, but yeah, to save your playlist. Okay. From there, we got that done. Basically, you want to back out of the interaction menu of the menu and go inside the yellow circle. But the UOP mission is right here. You get the options, press right on the D pad. From there, you want to do next. You want to select an outfit that you want with the IA badge. So, select an outfit that you want the, with the IA badge. So, I want this outfit that I have on right now. I want the IA badge on this outfit. So, yeah, from here, open your pause menu, go to online, go to playlist, go to my playlist, and drop the one that we create with the stun race. Alright, the start of the one that we're creating, we must want to spam around the D pad and then press X and press X, okay? So I'm gonna spam around the D pad right now and then press X. So I'm gonna keep spamming until I load in. And I always do that, but yeah. From here, you should spawn in the mission with the ULP, ULP title and the description on the, on the top. It's there, that means it works. Sometimes it might not work, you see in a little bit. From here, you want to confirm settings. If you want to press play. Alright, from here we should press play, basically you want to do is loading. If you spawn with the IA building, which is that it means it works. But if you don't, you spawn with the racing stunt race background, that means it did not work. Basically you want to exit out the race and redo the steps again. Okay? So if you got it working like me, you spawn with the IA buildings in the background, ready up. So yeah, so you, I'm using the first mission. Using the first mission, we get the cutscene. It takes about 40 seconds, but any mission, any any other UAP mission, would load it straight in the mission. Okay. So it takes a couple of seconds. So yeah. So yeah, for me, I have to wait like 40 seconds. So I was just waiting. You see my big head outfit with the big spinch right here. So yeah, I got the eye badge you see right there. The eye badge on my outfit. So you loaded me into the mission. All right, we're about to be loading to the mission right now. So yeah, once you load in the mission, you respond with the eye badge. So yeah, for me, want to head over to any one of your apartments, the closest one, and save your outfit. So yeah, see you guys. All right, guys. For me, we have to start your apartment. And for me, if you guys have a double back on your outfit, it will not let you save it because it will not let you access your clothing area. So you just want to remove your duffel bag and then save it and need this after you leave the mansion you can just re-add your duffel bag on your outfit and then save it. But yeah. So yeah, I got the eye badge on my outfit. Kinda cool. So yeah, for me once in your apartment you wanna go downstairs to the clothing area and basically you wanna press around the pad and basically you wanna save your outfit in a slot. It could be in the same slot that you have save or a different slot, it doesn't matter. So yeah, once you guys got that done for me, you want to back out, open your phone, and quit the mission. So yeah, just quit the mission, and yeah, see so you guys want to spawn in the lobby. Alright, we're about to spawn in the lobby right now. And look at that, we got the outfit. You should spawn with the outfit, but no I have badge. But we already save an outfit with the badge in the mission. So check your slot that you save your outfit with the badge. So my own reaction menu and I'll put on the outfit that I save with the badge and boom look at that. We got it. So yeah this method is still working after uh, like a month and you should try it on your male and female character guys. Also you could do it again to get the eye badge on another outfit because you could keep repeating the steps again on a different outfit. But yeah like and subscribe guys we're on the road to 4k subs. Like and subscribe for other outfits like male outfits and female outfits like always YouTube by smarts I'm out. Oh,